was a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, hold on Put me together Take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is all gone Wait, hold on Put me together Take me back where I belong I want it all all gone because I literally just yawned like four or five times and I've been up since 5 15 I thought my daughter was gonna wake up at 6 but nope she woke up an hour earlier so I've been up since then and I tried out a new nursing position today normally I just pick her up and hold her I decided to try nursing her on my side I'm still trying to figure it out because I feel like I'm not comfortable like my back is either arched in a way where it's like hurting or I feel like she's too snug up on my chest that she can't breathe so I'm still trying to figure that out she's so mad at me right now mommy knock on my mommy knock she stops crying the moment I pick her up every single time Hmm? Shh. It's okay, mommy right here. Mommy right here. I changed her diaper about 10 minutes ago and I have to change it again, but I didn't want her to leak because I was nursing her and she was tilted to the side. Oh no! Okay, she's like leaking on this. Okay. Oh man. Why are you leaking so much? <sighs> well, mommy's just gonna bathe you. I'm doing the laundry downstairs, so I'm sorry if it's a little loud. And I keep having to take off my glasses when I talk to the camera, because if I don't, there's gonna be a glare and it's just really annoying. Making some waffles, I already ate two just about like 10 minutes ago, but I'm still really, really hungry. I had some coffee this morning, so I'm like super fatigued and I haven't ate like a meal. I just ate two croissants earlier while I had my coffee. So I'm really hungry and I'm eating with some strawberries whipped cream and just syrup just like how I did with my pancakes when I made them the other day. I'm gonna eat this. I did not care to plate it really nicely because honestly I don't have time for that because my baby is sleeping. Eating a meal is not the same anymore. I feel like I'm always on a race like if I don't hurry up and eat she's gonna wake up or she wakes up while I'm eating and I don't get to finish it so I feel like I have to do things very quickly in order to beat her wake up time. I'm just finishing up changing my daughter's diaper. It's already, I think, almost 10 o'clock. We've been up already, but we've just been laying in bed. I nursed her and just been playing with her. So it's just been a really nice and relaxed morning. My husband is cutting our grass because it's so long. And yesterday it rained so hard while we were eating dinner. It was like downpouring rain, which is my favorite type of rain. So I went over to his grandparents' house and just hung out with the family and came home. Gave her a really nice bath so that she could feel clean and just 
prepare to bed afterwards. It is Memorial Weekend and I think we are planning to go to the furniture store and buy a couch. She looks so cute in this outfit today. I just found it yesterday. Okay, mama. Okay. She's hungry, so I'm gonna nurse her and pretty sure she's gonna fall asleep. She's been up for a little bit. Okay, say hello. Say hi. Hi, friends. So I just got done doing my makeup and I didn't even hear my daughter wake up. I'm gonna go wash my hands and I just saw from a distance that her eyes were open. And she's so cute. She's so content. She's just laying there and I love it when she wakes up without crying. She's gonna want me to hold her. Every time she wakes up, she likes to be held. Hi. Oh, her eyes are so watery. Hi, honey. Mommy missed you. I miss you. What's wrong? Oh, okay. Mommy, look. Mommy, look. Mommy, papa. Appa, appa. She's wide awake now. I'm just waiting to change her diaper. She only slept for about like an hour, so she just took like a quick nap. I like it when she gets like enough sleep in, so that way she's not cranky and she's just in like a better mood. I think we might go shopping for her as well. I need to buy her a few more of these like long sleeves. When she sleeps at night, she likes to put her arms out, so she's in a short sleeve. Her arms get exposed and they're like really cold when I nurse her, so I don't want her to get cold. We also need to go buy some more doggy bags. This is just what we put her diapers in. And um, we've already went through this pack already. So we're definitely going to have to buy quite a few. I didn't think we were going to go through them this quickly. But I should have knew better. Hi guys, so I'm in the car. My husband went into the store, so me and baby are just waiting inside the car. And we just left the mall about like 10 minutes ago, and I thought there'd be a lot more people, but it's actually really dead. We did a little bit of shopping. Actually didn't leave the house until like three. Things are definitely a lot different with a baby, and it just really depends if I know we're gonna go somewhere. And if I want to leave the house early, I just get up earlier and we can, you know, get out of the house, but like, at least 10 30 or 11 it just depends but um yeah because so far she's still really little i usually have her diaper bag like ready at all times and i will get myself ready it doesn't take me long the only thing that's hard is like when she wakes up i like to nurse her so that way when we leave the house i know she's not hungry and it also avoids me having to nurse her out in public even though we do bring um some milk with us i do pump and today i thought out a frozen pack because I knew we were going to be out for a little bit and I wanted to make sure that I have enough milk for her so that way when she does get hungry I can feed her. Look how cute my baby is. She was sleeping next to me because I was nursing her and I was on my phone and then I didn't realize that she actually flipped herself over like this and she's so stinking cute. This is the first time sleeping on her belly. Look at her cute little feet. Oh, so cute. I love her little baby toes. There's a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by 
doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return Today is Thursday and this morning I took my daughter We went to the store, we went to go run some errands I had to go buy some ingredients. We're only gone for about like an hour. Right when we were about to get home, she woke up. So it was kind of perfect timing. Tomorrow, our new couch is coming in. It's the same couch that we have right now. It's just in a different color. I'm so excited to just get like another couch. So that way, we're not just squeezing in on one couch because baby sleeps on one end. So we only have the middle and the other end of the couch. It is going to make our living room space a little bit smaller. Sometimes you just have to make some sacrifices and especially living in like a smaller home. So I finished cooking and I just need to fold the laundry. I took care of some bills. So we moved the two chairs right here. This is where the second couch is going to go. It's so much more spacious like this. But then once we do get the couch, um, it is going to push it up a little bit further to here. So this whole area right here, it's going to be a lot smaller. But it is what it is. And we will have to push this couch all the way to the wall as close as we can. We've been sharing this space right here. So I would usually sit here and edit. My husband will sit here and the baby just sleeps over here. Since she's getting taller, she's obviously taking up more space. moving the couches I decided to put the darker couch on this end so that way when we open the window the light could shine on it and it just sits in a corner instead of being in front of a window where it's going to cause a shadow and make it look even darker it probably still would have went with our house anyways our carpet does have like that darker brown tone to it as you guys can tell but um i just prefer a lighter color but it's okay it is what it is i don't like that it's not aligned in the middle with the back window right there but again at this point it does not matter <laughs> it is what it is we have another couch to sit on which is the whole purpose of it so my little girl is wide awake again she just took a power nap her dad should be home in a little bit here 